Okay, uh, today I'll be showing you how to collate your scores and how to send um, those calls to the students. Okay, um, the, the first video I showed you how you can set your quiz questions for the students so they can be able to answer. But as a teacher, you need to know how to um, um, collate your scores, get them on a sheet, and um, and also do a manual review on those scores and send it to the students. Okay, so uh, you really don't want the students to actually see their, their scores immediately because that will, be, that will not be a good practice, but you really want them to actually answer the questions and wait for some time before actually getting their scores. So I'll be showing you those things in practical right now. So um, I'm actually on the Google Classroom, the mobile app, the mobile, the, 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 um, the mobile app. So I, I go to Classwork. And here I have already designed a computer test for J3 Kushefat. And um, um, okay, so I go here. Yeah, so I click here, and there I will see students have already turned in. I'm, I'm logged in as um, a teacher. Okay, I'm logged in as a teacher. And um, here we have what is a computer, and of course the computer test. Okay, so I want to see how many students answered this um, um, computer test. Uh, question quiz question so i click um, view live form and view sh response in sheet uh, view response in sheet shows you the response of the students but normally we have to create it so we go to view live form click on the view live form and this is the question i've set 10 10 questions i have said so what i will do is i click here i click here here and uh, I cancel here. I click here. And uh, once we have done that, once we have done that, we we'll click here. Now we go over to the response. We go over to the response there, which I've clicked on it. We go back to the response, and then we can see the, stu uh, the response of the students. Each of them will see um, the maximum, uh, virtually all of them got um, everything. I don't die. God, make sure they got everything. Take, take out, please. God. Virtually all of them got everything. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, then we have um, the students who have answered. Um, did I select it to be one? Um, I'm, I'm very sure I did just one. <clears throat> okay, so. Um, Come in, please. Let me check something. Settings. Um, okay. To just one response. So let's go back. So this is what we do now. Um, we can see the scores. The students have not seen their scores, uh, but we can actually see see them here. So what we do now is um, we go over to this place, and um, we can actually release the scores to the students. Okay. Release the scores to the students over here. Release the scores. Release the scores to the students, and we'll click here to release the scores to the students. And then we can select um, the students we want to release the scores to. We can select the students we want to actually re release the scores and the message to actually go with that. Okay, and then we send it to their mail. Then we can also come here and um, create it. Create the response. We can come here to actually create. Um, the response and this is how we are going to do that. Um, we come here to this green, to this green thing here. We come here to create it, and I uh, will click on this, and um, create a new uh, spreadsheet. It's going to create a new spreadsheet, as a, and then we can put it as a, not a blank quiz, but we name it as computer, computer quiz, and we create it. Now. Once this has been created, link it to spreadsheet is going to open with our, our Google Doc. Okay, it's going to open with our Google Doc, and I'm going to use this as my account to actually open it up. Opening in Google Sheet is going to open. I have a Google Sheet. It's going to open in Google Sheet. I've installed. I've installed my Google Sheet. It's going to open in Google Sheet, and then we can see the time and the the date and the time these students um, signed in and their email address. Here we can be able to see their email address and of course their scores. Okay, and we can be able to see the questions they answered. Computer is dash 
and dash or whatever they are able to see their you were able to see the questions and the likes of them and the scores and of course this makes it um very 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 easy so yes um i guess um that's it for um, for that so if there are any questions um please um do well to hit me up and i'll try as much as possible um to reply so thank you